welcome. Today I'm going to share with you all a very simple and tasty recipe for lobster ravioli. And I'm using the store-bought lobster, lobster ravioli. Um, this is a little tedious for me to make, so this is just the easy way out. So if you all see this in the supermarket and you want to try it, then by all means you can try this. You don't have to get a lobster one, you can get whichever filling that you like. And the other things you'll need for this recipe, you'll need some spinach, some bacon, a piece of butter and some tomatoes, salt and pepper to taste. So we're going to start by putting our ravioli to boil and here I have my water that's already come up to a boil. I'm going to put the pasta in and you're going to boil your pasta according to the instructions on your package. So mine said four to five minutes. So I'm going to let this boil and then I'll strain it and then we'll come back and assemble. So put up a pot to heat up. And to that pot, you're going to add in your bacon. Now, if you don't want to add bacon to this, you don't have to. So we want this bacon to start to render out in here. When the bacon starts to crisp up, add in your tomatoes. And you want the tomatoes to start to soften. When the tomatoes have broken down and they've gotten really soft and if you don't have any sauce like I do in your pot you can just add a little bit of water that's okay. So at this point you're going to add in your pasta or your ravioli and add in your spinach and if you wanted to chop up the spinach you can but I'm just leaving mine cool. And I'm putting in a piece of butter. So just mix everything together. And we want the spinach to wilt down. Now if you prefer to use a different type of greens for this, you can. Or if you wanted to use a variety of vegetables, you can. I'm just going to season this with a little bit of black pepper. We'll taste the salt after. So this just has like about a minute again to go and then it will be ready. Okay so this is finished. I'm going to take this off and I'm going to dish it out and show you guys what it looks like. Make sure you also taste it for salt. I tasted mine and with the bacon it has just enough so salt. So here you have it, my lobster ravioli recipe. I hope you guys enjoy this quick and easy recipe. Make it and let me know down below if you like it. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all another day with another one of my recipes. Enjoy!